Today's topic is heat stroke. Heat stroke is an illness marked by an elevation in the body's temperature, usually as a result of prolonged exposure to high temperature. Heat stroke results in a body temperature greater than 40 degrees Celsius or 104 degrees Fahrenheit or higher. The condition is most common in the summer months and is the most serious heat-related illness. Heat stroke is a medical emergency and can be fatal if not promptly and properly treated. Untreated heat stroke can quickly damage multiple organs, including the brain, lungs, liver, muscles, digestive tracts, circulatory system, and kidneys. The longer treatment is delayed, the more the damage worsens, increasing the risk of serious complications and even death. The Center for Disease Control and Prevention, or CDC, estimates that the condition kills more than 600 people in the United States each year. There are two types of heat stroke, exertional and non-exertional. Exertional heat stroke occurs in people whose bodies are no longer able to adapt to rising temperatures due to intense physical activities, such as exercising or working in hot weather. Non-exertional heat stroke occurs in people who are unable to adapt well to an increasingly hot temperature in a hot environment. Causes Exposure to a hot environment Strenuous work in hot weather or a heated room Dehydration Alcohol consumption Wearing excess clothing Anybody can develop heat stroke, but certain factors that may increase your risk are Age Children under the age of four are at an increased risk because their central nervous system isn't fully developed and the ability of their body to regulate temperature is more difficult. Adults aged 65 and above are also at an increased risk because the central nervous system begins to deteriorate with age, making the body less able to cope with temperature changes. A lack of air conditioning. A sudden exposure to hot weather certain medications that may affect the body's ability to stay hydrated, such as medications used to treat high blood pressure, such as beta blockers, diuretics, some antidepressants, and cocaine. Certain health conditions, such as obesity, heart disease, lung disease. A previous history of heat stroke. Symptoms. The high body temperature of 40 degrees Celsius or higher hot, dry skin, confusion, agitation, slurred speech, coma, seizures, loss of consciousness, rapid breathing, a headache, increased heart rate, red skin, the skin may turn red as the temperature increases, excessive sweating. Diagnosis and treatment. Diagnosis may be made on your symptoms but the doctor may decide to run tests to confirm the diagnosis or check for complications. A blood test to check potassium and sodium levels to help determine if you are dehydrated. The blood test may also be used to check the content of gases in the blood to see if there has been any damage to the central nervous system. A urine test to check for the color of the urine. A darker urine may indicate the heat-related condition. The urine test is also used to check the function of the kidney. Muscle function test may be performed to check for serious damage to the muscle tissue. X-ray and other imaging tests to check for any damage to the internal organs. Treatment. Treatment is aimed at cooling the body to a normal temperature to prevent complications. The doctor may immerse you in cold water, wrap you in a special cooling blanket, pack you in ice. In cases where the treatments make you shiver, the doctor may give you medications to stop the shiver. Home remedies such as rehydrating, taking a cool shower or bath, cooling off with a fan or damp sheet, going to a shady or air-conditioned place may help. Home remedies aren't enough for the condition. If you discover any symptom of heat stroke, seek medical help. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.